We're going to create a table based on an Excel spreadsheet. So in Microsoft Access at times you might want to go in an import information that's uh, created in other applications. So if you look at the menu external data, they, it gives you a whole lot of other applications that you might want to import information from. In this instance, I've created a table in Microsoft Excel that I want to go in and import. So if I go in and the name of the file I've uh, created there, it's called my previous high schools. So I want to import this into Microsoft Access. It is important uh, to see how Microsoft uh, Access import uh, information from other application. They calls the name of the worksheet. If the information was in worksheet number two and so on, I will be choosing from all the worksheets there. So I'm saying this are my uh, column headings, which are the first row of my uh, import data. Then the name, uh, the field names that I have here, I can then identify them there to say it's uh, text, it's date and time whatever the uh, data type I want to call it. I'll go next, next and um, it says uh, what do you want to import to. Uh, it's sheet one, it's fine and then we go next and then we close. So you will now then see that we've got a table called sheet one. Then while in Excel we might want to rename the worksheet and say uh, it's not sheet one, it's my previous high schools. Now, if we open this, uh, you will see then that it shows me all the high schools that are, you know, my previous high schools as per our database.